Now, I've gone ahead and drilled out the holes in the ribs for this rear bracket, support bracket. Because of the fact that I had my top skin already riveted on, <clears throat> I had to work around it to get down in here to drill the hole where I've already got a rivet put in. What I used <clears throat> is a very long number 40 drill bit. It's really really long. I put that in my drill and was able to get off here to the side and then by pushing down on it and kind of bending it and holding it at the same time I was able to drill a pilot hole. And I've got a few scratches on the aluminum here but nothing serious and then I was able to open that hole up to the number 30 size drill bit which is what you will need to pull the AA42 rivets. I don't know how well this will show up on the uh, video, but I've got a small machinist square, precision machinist square. <clears throat> I place it on the bottom rib and I take it right up against the edge of the bracket here just to make sure that I'm square with this bottom rib. And the insides, this bottom curve on the inside of this bracket on both ends is setting right up flush against the tubes without spreading them out or raising the height any. I've gone ahead and drilled the other holes to two in the top and the other one in the bottom here. Well, actually this is the top and this is the bottom. I got the wing upside down. So I can go ahead and put my AA42 rivets in here. And I'm holding the assembly in place with Clecos. Let's go ahead and pull this one out, pull the rivet on it. Now, at this point, that is still a size 40 hole, so I have to go in now. And open up that hole, so that it is now a size 40. Of course, I had everything laid out except my deburring tool. You want to make sure that you deburr all of these edges before you pull your rivets. So I'm going to go ahead and drill these holes out and deburr them. Now I did do that on the bottom there. I didn't do it on the top pieces yet. But since I've already got my holes drilled, it's just a matter of resizing them. Which can be done rather quickly. Then you just go ahead and take your little deburring tool. Take those little tiny edges off. There we go. Now, just a simple matter of taking the rivet squeezer. Get the rivet in there. Pull it through. Again, these are the AA42, that's all aluminum, AA42 rivets that are used to simply hold these brackets on. And the purpose of these brackets is nothing more than to add some compressibility strength here in the ribs at the root end. And as you can see, they hold very well. Now I need to do the same up here on the front part. <clears throat> 